It is going to be really nice. You know, we've been dealing with the wind. The wind is in the forecast for the next few days. I mean, honestly, I don't see the winds really lighting up until maybe next week. You've of got my... the ponytail, I've got the gel. So we're, we're good. <laughs> yes, we're good. it's that kind of day. You want to <laughs> make sure your hair is back. Uh, if you're wearing hats, hold on to your hats, right? So the breeze has pick, been picking up slowly throughout the morning hours, and it's already around 15 miles per hour sustained. Temperatures are starting off in those upper 70s along the coast. You know, when you got that ocean flow, it tends to keep uh, the temperatures mild overnight. But I will tell you this, it feels really comfortable when that breeze hits you. Honestly, it feels more like fall, South Florida style. And there's a look at those winds. So, so far the Treasure Coast and store, that's where we're starting to get breezier. But the further south you are, we've been already dealing with the breeze. No wind gusts at the moment, but from time to time, We'll start to get some of those reports of wind gusts and then by the middle of the day, they'll be more consistent around 25 miles per hour. So let's talk about that super seven day forecast. I want to focus in on tomorrow because tomorrow we could have some more of these passing showers. We've had a few this morning in the Treasure Coast, but it looks like, you know, mainly in the afternoon hours for Palm Beach County tomorrow, we'll have some of those passing showers. But again, look how isolated it is. Basically, you know, if uh, anybody gets rain, it's going to probably last for a few minutes as the showers move really quickly towards the west. And then we could get a few more rounds behind those showers. But overall, rain chance still relatively low. Humidity goes up a little bit throughout today. Tomorrow then goes back down on Halloween. Let's go ahead and talk about that trick or treat forecast. Halloween in the afternoon is going to be nice. Windy temperatures in the low to mid 80s. Then at night, in the evening through the late night hours, temperatures in the upper 70s, still windy. That's actually going to make things feel really nice. So uh, we're not getting a cold front, but at least we're not sweating in our costumes either.